you might not need HTTP. Let me explain why. Let's say you have a function that takes string parameter and returns string. We want to execute the function on a server and invoke it remotely from our laptop. To do this, we can run HTTP server. But actually, for this use case, we could use TCP server instead. No HTTP headers, no bloat, just messages. First, let's run this function locally. We will grab a command line argument and pass it to the function, run the function, and print the return value. It works. Next, we'll create a TCP server. First, import create server function from Node.js built-in net module. Create the server and listen to port 3000. On the handler side, each time a data is received by a socket, we pass the data to the function. Run the function, write the return value to the socket, and close the connection. Next, we'll create a TCP client. First, create new socket object from net module, connect it to port 3000 on the server's IP address. When connected, grab the command line argument and write it to the socket. When a data is received, print it. So let's run the server and query it from the client. It works. So for your next project, should you start by using TCP? I think the answer is no. If you build an app and start it with TCP, you will be giving up a lot on features HTTP and its ecosystem provides, especially the fact that HTTP have browser as client and HTML as UI is a huge win. Browser is everywhere, no need to install special client or anything, and by utilizing HTML, we can write few lines of plain text and we instantly get graphical user interface. So you don't need HTTP doesn't necessarily mean you better not use HTTP. So my conclusion here is if you need remote procedure call on your project, start with HTTP and switch to another protocol when it's appropriate. Subscribe for more content. Thank you for watching and see you.